Let's talk about Colts. Let's talk about everybody. Let's talk about everybody. Play us out. And then the lightning round is over. Are you ready? Ski daddy. Time for the light round. Let's start with Tim in Texas. Tim. Hey, Jim. Booyah. Booyah. What's up? Not much. I wanted to ask you about this talk WWE. It's had a good run. I don't think it's a 50%. I would not want to come in at this level. I am uh, actually quite encouraged by how well the company is run. I had some people who work there, and it's just a much better outfit than most people think. Let's go to Tom in Texas. Tom. Hey, Jim. Hi, long-time listener, first-time caller. How are you? Oh, thank you for calling. What's up? Well, first of all, we appreciate all what you do for all of us, and we look forward to your call tomorrow. But my uh, question's on the cruise kind. line. We're good call tomorrow. Good call tomorrow. Yeah, go ahead. Well, my question on the cruise lines. I know you're a big fan of Norwegian. I was on a Royal one a week ago and totally booked and went to book the next one. And they said, we're booked out eight months before you can get on again. I mean, I used Norwegian. I happened to like wanted to book one on Norwegian. I was going to book one right before COVID started. I think that they're all very well run. Royal Caribbean is an excellent, excellent company. Let's go to Warren in Hawaii. Warren. Aloha from from Maui, Mahalo, Hawaii. my friend. Mahalo. He's one of my Mahalo. Ohio, of my Ohio. Yes, what's up? Yes. What I'd like to find out is your uh, thing, what you could tell me about uh, LNTH, Lantis Holding. On the just, you know, look, there is a company that was at one point up five today, about four. It's now down two, and it finished at 274. And its name is Danaher, and I'm going to talk about it tomorrow at the Investing Club. And I got to tell you, I think it's a heck of a lot better than than LANT. I'm much better. Let's go to Tom in California. Tom. Hey, Jim. Thanks for taking my call. Hey, oh, Tom, of course. Patient, oh, I continue to be a long patient fan of uh, Cleveland Cliff, determined to stay the course. You still a fan? Okay. Uh, not as much as I am of Nucor. I think the numbers may be too high in Cliffs. I think the numbers may be too low in Nucor. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the conclusion of the Lightning Round. The Lightning Round is sponsored by TD Ameritrade. Coming up, what can you learn from the FTX debacle? Rules to protect your assets. Next. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.